Hey folks, Mike and McGee here. In today's video, we're back in the potato patch and we're gonna look to see if we're being successful. As you know, we planted these in February. My buddy down at TM Automotive, old Steve, he said his parents and the old timers back in the day always would plant their potatoes in February. But now, since then, a lot of people have stopped doing that, possibly because the weather has changed. Maybe they had negative results or maybe they just didn't want to get out in the cold and do it i don't know i haven't talked to any of them that stopped doing it but i know one thing last year i did a test and planted half well i planted my red potatoes in february and i planted my uh kennebags and my yellow yukon golds in warmer weather like march or april i'm telling you my early potatoes looked better produced more than the ones I planted in warmer weather. I mean, they look spindly to me, the, the ones I planted in warm weather. Now, we're down here looking at the ones we planted in February. We planted all of them in February this year, knocked it out in one mighty swoop. I'm telling you, they look good. They're bushy, they're green, they are vibrant, and they're blooming. And it's time to get in here and cultivate them as you can see, I've mowed in between the rows. That's the way we set this up since it's on the hillside. I left grass between the rows so that we don't have erosion. And so far, it has worked perfectly. I mean, absolutely tremendously. potato beetles and I'm not exactly sure why I didn't have potato beetles last year when I planted them over here this is a new spot never had potatoes in it as far as I know here's one right here this is just the larva of a potato beetle that's coming on he's already up on the plant eating wide open Lo and behold, I have found potato bugs. Not good at all. They're in the early stage and they only really range just right here. As far as I can tell, about a 12 foot row. I don't see them on any other plant or any other row at this point. So I have no choice but to go in here, grab these little jokers because they will eat it up. You see what's happening right here? That is nothing compared to what they will do if they don't go away. And it's time for them to go away. One, two, three. Here we go. No chickens around this area. No ducks around this area. Wild turkeys might would eat them. But they're not. They're not. So it's time for Big Daddy to do his squashy squash. You can't be afraid of a little bug juice. I really don't like to spray unless I have to. And right now, it don't look like I have to. I just pinch the bugs off that I see. Now, if my plants start going to pot, yes, I will definitely spray. But as of right now, I think I can manage it. I'm not gonna be putting the potatoes back here next year. I never put them back till at least four years go by. I'm gonna get out here and I'm gonna cultivate this real quick. You can see my orchard, we picked the hay up out of it. It's looking great. We're hoping to have some apples as well. So let's get in here and do this. It don't take long to cultivate potatoes. You just throw it down the middle and take off. And really, the faster you go, the better. It throws that dirt, and it actually pulls it up around the potatoes a little bit. It's not. It doesn't have a calder or a hiller on it, 
but it does throw the dirt in. And I like that, that helps a lot. And on a hillside like this, I didn't know how it was gonna be being able to keep the back of the tractor lined up with the front of the tractor, but it is working great. Now, the February part is only gonna really matter to people in my, in my planting zone and maybe even really in my local area, I don't know. If you're way up north, you can't do it. If you're way down south, if you're in Florida, Texas, Mississippi, Alabama, you're probably laughing at me saying, yeah, we plant them in January. I don't know, but I know one thing. Here in Tennessee, this is considered very strange to plant them this early. I had a lot of people looking at me sideways, crooked and upside down, but now if they were to come and look at them, I think they'd be impressed. But that's all we got for you today, folks. If you grow potatoes, I hope that you can try this. Plant them a little earlier than warm weather. They do not mind. You, you They frost. These potatoes frosted, turn pretty black. They come right back. I think they come back better and stronger than ever. But that's all we got for you today, folks. Hope you have a great day. We'll see you on the next video.